I know we haven't been together that long, but these last 10 months have just been the happiest of my life. You're not only the person I love, you're also my best friend. And I want to spend the rest of my life with you. Will you marry me? Yes. Seriously, do you think that sounds good? No. Really? Because I think that kind of sums up but everything. No! Oh, oh, sorry, sorry. Sometimes these catheters can pinch a little bit. <laughs> well, thanks for listening. I really appreciate it. You got a real gentle touch there, Doctor. She won't be able to say no. Actually, I'm a nurse. Doctor will be right in. <laughs> Okay, it's time for our problem of the week. I want you to pick out your problem, the problem that's been bothering you all week, with your eyes so closed. I want you to picture that problem in your mind. Pretend that it's right there in front of you. Not only with my best friend, but you're also the person that I want to spend the rest of my life with. I love you. Will you marry me? I want you to scare your problems away. I want you to say boo. Boo! boo! <laughs> All right, you guys are great. Very good. I will see you guys after lunch. All right? Okay. Hey, Pam, isn't that your special friend outside? Yeah, I think so. Why don't you go talk to him? You think you should? Yeah! <laughs> Come here. <laughs> Hi, sweetie. How you doing? What's going on? I just was in the neighborhood, got off work a little early, thought maybe you wanted to go get a bite to eat or something. Oh, that's very sweet. What a nice surprise. What? <laughs> oh, shoot. I forgot to change my shoes. That's okay. You don't have to change. You know I can't resist a man in nurse's shoes. I know, but I got my sneakers in my backpack. I'm just gonna change. It'll just take a second. <laughs> okay. Honey? Hmm? Pam? Yeah. I love you. I love you, too. Come on, sweetie. I've got a half hour before I have to be back, so uh, you want to go have lunch? <laughs> what are you doing? I'm nothing. I just love you so much. These last ten months have been the happiest of my life. Yeah, they've been amazing. But what, what's going on? Nothing. I just, I, just, I just feel like, you know, we're so close. You're my best friend, and you're also the woman that I love, and... Are you okay, sweetie? You're acting so weird. I'm fine. I just got a crick in my neck. I was doing CPR on a 300-pound oh crack goodness. at it this morning. Do you want me to massage your neck or something? Do you need no, 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 no. Up? I'm fine. Sure? I'm good. Honey, look, your kids, they're trying to what? tell you something. What? Look! Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, it's my sister. Hello? Hi! I'm engaged. You're engaged? That's wonderful. Congratulations. Oh, my God, you're getting married in two weeks. It's it's a little soon, isn't it? Wow, Mom and Dad really don't know Bob very well. Dad was okay with this? Wow, that was very thoughtful of him. I can't believe he knew to ask Dad's permission. Yeah. No, I'm just here with Greg. He's gonna take me out for lunch. He's okay. Okay, I know you gotta go. All right, I love you. Okay, I'll talk to you soon. Bye. So what's going on? What, Debbie's marrying that guy? Yeah, in two weeks. Dr. Bob of Denver. <laughs> That's, Isn't that great? Yeah, yeah, that's, that's... Didn't they just meet, like, a few months ago? Well, yeah, but, you know, he asked her, and she said yes. Actually, he asked my dad. He said yes, and then he asked Debbie. Huh, yeah, I overheard that. So what, like, he had asked his permission, or...? Well, no, he didn't have to. Bob just understood that Dad appreciates that kind of thing, you know? Hmm, mm hmm Anyway, Deb said that Dad's crazy about him. Evidently, Bob bought him, like, the perfect gift that just won him over, you know? Really? Huh, a gift. Are you sure it's okay to x-ray this? Yeah, it's not gonna mutate or anything. Uh, sir, that's not gonna fit. Wait, hang on a second. The bag's too big, guy. You gotta check it. Over here. Raise your arms, sir. 
I got an engagement ring from my girlfriend in the bag, so I can't really open it here. So don't you think I can maybe just carry it on? Hey, pal, if it ain't fitting true to frame, you ain't carrying it on the plane. 531, New York LaGuardia. Check it. Wait, wait. Excuse me. Don't Good. worry, pal. We'll be waiting for you on the other side. Excuse me. Hi. Uh, you lost my bag, and there's a two-carat diamond ring inside it. I didn't lose your anything, sir. We'll put your local address on this form, and we'll ship it when it surfaces. And what if it doesn't? Am I supposed to spend the entire weekend with just the clothes on my back? <laughs> it's a great gift. I just thought you were going to get them champagne. Trust me, I think your dad is going to be very psyched about this gift. Well, don't forget he's retired, though. The guy was in the rare flower business for 30 years. I think he still maintains an interest. Well, you make it seem like they're really hard to please. No, not at all. He's the sweetest man in the whole world. Just relax. He's going to love you, I promise. As much as he loves Dr. Bob. <laughs> Take it easy on the sarcasm. Humor is entirely wasted on my parents. What, are they Amish? <laughs> <laughs> hey, no jokes. What are you doing? What? I told you my dad sees smoking as a sign of weakness. OK, all right, I'll leave him in the car. No, 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 he'll check there, he'll check there. Oh, gosh. Okay, what? Ugh. Yeah, the roof is probably a better idea. Hey. Oh, and um, we're not living together. I thought you said you told them. Well, hi, Daddy. <laughs> Oh, I missed oh. you so much. I missed you too, oh. Flapjack. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. <laughs> short stack, short stack, coming up. up. <laughs> Where's oh. my little girl? Hey, mommy. Oh. Oh. Hey, mom. <gasps> you look so beautiful. Oh, so do you. Oh. Look at you. Oh, I'm sorry. Mom, Dad, this is Greg. <laughs> Hi, Greg. I'm Pam's father, Jack Burns. Yeah, it's great to finally meet you. Good and meeting I'm you. Dina. Welcome oh, to Oyster thanks. Bay, Gre Thank Greg. You. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what are you driving there, Ford? Oh, uh, yeah, it's a Taurus. Yeah, we were going to get a midsize, but I figure, hey, I'll pull down decent bucks. Might as well go all out, pop for the full size. <laughs> sure. Oh. Interesting color. You pick it? Oh, no, the guy at the counter. Why? Well, they say geniuses pick green. But you didn't pick it. <laughs> Jack. <laughs> oh, yucky, what <clears throat> smells of old sour milk? Oh, poor Greg got spit up on oh. by a baby. He didn't. Yeah. yeah, he did, Ma. At the lost luggage counter, the airline lost his bag. Oh, oh. they didn't. Yeah. Yeah, they did. What about you, honey? Oh, no, 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 I carried on. That's my girl. <laughs> It'll turn up, I'm sure. And anyway, Greg, meanwhile, anything you need, just ask, huh? That's right. Mikasa su casa. Oh, thanks, Jack. You too. Come on, yeah. <laughs>